Yeah, oh God, it's a privilege to have you here. You know, in our previous lesson, we talk about our uh, one of the basic uh, mystery of success, and I was telling you the, the first prominent and ultimate uh, mystery of success is to have an ultimate objective. There is a superior objective you ought to have in order to delve into the cycle of success. So today I'm going to give you scriptures, uh, uh, examples and realities, scriptural truth and secret on how to exploit success. Okay, uh, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. We talk about success. We mentor and teach on finances and success. Okay, this is a, a scriptural uh, day we are going to take for our success tip. Okay, these are not just tip. They are realities and truth. They are mysteries that can exploit your 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 successful dimension or, or aspect of life. So thank you very much. Oh, uh, I would like us to look at the book of Daniel chapter one verses number seventeen. But before I proceed, uh, I think the theme of this uh, message that I'm giving to you concerning success, the title. I would like to tie to is um, the mystery, okay? You know, when we're talking about mystery, we, we don't really mean that these are hidden things. Mysteries sometimes, most especially when it comes to success, they are not really hidden. But because we have not yet uncovered them, they seem to be hidden. There are strategy a lot of people have used and exploit to success. But because you have not known it, it has become a mystery to you. That's the reason why I want to exploit this until this day. So that it won't become a mystery, but what? A reality and a truth. So what is left now? You take action towards it. To maximize your success in life and I know someone who had lived in accordance to this reality and he exploits success and who is that that is Daniel that's the reason why I would love us to look at the book of Daniel shortly okay Daniel chapter 1 verses 17 is very very an interesting scripture this guy had lived towards this realities and truth and he exploited success okay and then i want to also uh, recommend this strategy this mystery this truth and reality to us that we what we enable the possibility of our own success in life and shortly before i proceed i would like you to know that success is not just uh, ordinarily principles, precepts, and methodologies alone. So sex is basically centered spiritually, okay? So I know a, a man that knew the spiritual dominancy of sex, and when he began to dive into this dimension, he was able to exploit his success. The Bible said in the book of Daniel, it said, They that know their God shall do exploit. What is it trying to talk? It is not really uh, uh, trying to emphasize on religion. It is trying to basically place in emphatical realities on spirituality. They that know their God. So you must have a God. You must be able to connect to the spiritual dimension. Because there is no way you can access a God in a physical realm. You must have a spiritual connection, a spiritual reality, a spiritual aspect in which you should put all your, your emphasis upon in order to exploit success. So Daniel knew how mighty and powerful the possibility of his life with God. So he began to place his unionship, to place his future, to place all his possibilities upon God. So God became the priority because he knew with God there was nothing impossible. That was how this young man exploited success. Although in chaos situation, although in difficult, hazardous, uh, unbearable situation, he sustained because he was connected to a spiritual realm that was superior. 
and this uh today in this video i want to explore you to uh, a superior dimension in which you can connect to explore your success this guy had lived this very life i know an ultimate god the king of kings and the lord of lords who is still blessing people the god of daniel I would like you, if you have not read vividly this story, go back to your Bible and read the story of Daniel and you begin to understand the exploit he has made. But for the sake of this video, I'm just going to explore you one of the basic mysteries of success. Alright, so here we go. I will take the Bible verse. Of, uh, we are reading the book of Daniel chapter 1 verses number 17. And it says, this is a new international version I have over here with me. It says, God give these four young men an unusual appetite for understanding every aspect of ritual and wisdom. And God gave Daniel the special ability to interpret the meaning of dreams and visions. Praise the Lord. See, the first reality, the first aspect, the first mystery of success is an appetite people everybody you see being successful was as a, as a result of their appetite this is even beyond the mindset when they teach you about hypnosis and all of that it is beyond having an objective see you can have an objective you can have an allegiance but without the appetite to explore it it will never come to pass you can have the dream but without an appetite to explore it it will come it will never come to pass see i show you a basic secret i know you have dreams i know you have ambitions and desire but the ultimate thing is without the appetite to exploit that you can never make it come to pass please work on yourself if that appetite has not yet been activated this is a basic mystery this is a basic truth and reality of exploring success that appetite must be there so god had to give them the appetite I want you to know that appetite to succeed is, is not just literal uh, connection. There is always a spiritual connection to give you the stamina and the appetite to be sustained in that dream. We have dreams. We have creative mindset. We visualize things in our mind. This is how we want to do it. This is how creative we are. But there is a superiority connecting that appetite. So God gave them the appetite. Do you have this appetite? That is the question. Because despite these dreams and ambitions, whatsoever it takes, your success will be limited because there is no appetite. This is a very basic thing. Daniel did not sustain his own appetite. Those four young men never sustained their own appetite. God had to give them an appetite. So it means you need a spiritual dimension to connect to the realm of success. I want to proceed with this scripture. I would like you to understand something down to verses 18. So I take it. It says, when the training period had been ordered by the king was completed, the chief of staff brought all the young men to the king, to King Nebuchadnezzar. The king talked with them and no one impressed him as much as Daniel, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. So they entered the lawyer service. This young man, why in the course of training? Because they had the appetite to obtain and understand the wisdom and the literature that was taught. They became what? Superior people. They became men of intelligentsia. So when they come to an examination point, they made great explosion, they made great impression, and the king become amazed because there was no one who could perform as they were able to perform. This is the secret of appetite. When that appetite is there, see, appetite for success is bigger than every other limitation. This appetite is as a result of uh, a kind of, uh, it is placed as an obsession. When you have 
of sexual nothing stop you sickness cannot stop you pains cannot stop you you don't have money it is not an issue you you there is no obstacle because there is a burning appetite a lot of people have been asking this question i have walked i have done this i want to become successful in everything i do there have been a failing dimension of it how do i succeed today i bring to you a mystery you must have an appetite how do we get this appetite see the only source of getting this appetite is connected to the world to the spirit realm. so when this young man knew that he began to pray he would pray three times a day because he needed an appetite to exploit success you need the gift of appetite you need this gift and the only way you can drop it is in the spirit realm so i i give you a mystery go to your core today God the mind and still gives appetite to succeed. You will not succeed. You can only do this spiritual. Thank you very much. Stay tuned. Subscribe, follow, and share all my social media channels.